most Dolphin fans, and really anyone that follows the NFL in general, seems to think that Miami's going to draft a quarterback in the upcoming 2020 draft. This obviously is not an irrational take. They did bench second-year quarterback Josh Rosen and start the veteran quarterback Ryan Fitzpatrick after all, and they're likely going to get at least a top-five pick. Most teams that pick that high go for quarterbacks, and apparently Steven Ross has also talked about how much he likes Tua. But I am here to tell you that this is not the case, and that is a good thing. Yes, quarterback is the most important position, but no quarterback can do good with absolutely no O-line helping him. We put blame on the O-line all the time, but this year's Dolphins offensive line is bad. I believe they're tied for last in sacks allowed, and their freaking veteran quarterback is their leading rusher. Obviously that blame can go to the running backs as well, but not all of it. This Dolphins offense actually has potential to be pretty good in the future. They have really good receivers, and yes, they need to upgrade at running back, but that position's not going to go anywhere if there's no O-line to create holes for them. You see what I'm getting at here? This clearly needs to be the primary focus the entire offseason for the Dolphins. Build an O-line. And I do also think that the benching of Josh Rosen is a misunderstanding. Yes, it looks bad. But I think this was more of a way to protect Rosen. They knew that there was just no way he was going to succeed behind the O-line that he had. And they also just, you know, they didn't want him to get killed. I feel like they plan to develop him. They're doing the right thing and just letting him sit behind and watch Fitzpatrick do his thing and learn. He's been coming into practice early and he leaves late and he's showing that he wants to be the quarterback of the future. And I actually think the Dolphins are buying it. They probably have seen enough potential in him to give him another shot next year. And this time, it's a real shot. It's one that he's never had in his entire NFL career. He's had the worst O-line in both years he's played, which is terrible for an inexperienced rookie. That's why I still don't like the excuse of, oh, well, you know, it doesn't matter anymore because Fitzpatrick's doing well with that O-line. Yeah, of course he's doing better. He's been in the league since 2004. Rosen's been here since 2018, and he didn't have any shot of experience because O-lines were terrible both years. He's still a young player with potential, and it would be smart to get the Dolphins an offensive line and build around him. Drafting a quarterback is not just going to magically save the Dolphins. They need to help build around those rookies so they can ultimately get to that level. Please, Dolphins, be smart about this.